Mike. Yes. Yes, Tom. Yes, Tom. Born and raised. So since we're talking about politics, this is my ode to our former president, a passionate young senator from Chicago who could give a motivating speech strong enough that can move a non-motivated person into action. He has a way with words, but not too rhymy like our boy, Jesse Jackson. He has class, style, and swag like no other. He is a two-time Ivy League graduate, Columbia University and Harvard Law, if you fact check it. He's even easy on the eyes, which got him a vote from some of our simpletons. He chased the dream and not the almighty dollar. He even became Martin Luther King's dream realized. He is fit, and he never neglected his basketball game. A proud dad of two sweet girls. He is a community-minded man, always concerned about others. Even the, the, in, in the midst of him being elected to the presidency for the first time, he reached in and whispered, are you okay, to his queen. Always putting the welfare of others before his own. His imperfections had become known to the public. You know, he smoked a little Mary Jane in college, but he still made it to the White House. His black hair eventually... <laughs> His black hair eventually turned gray due to the stressful demands of holding the highest office in the land. That's my president, President Barack Obama. Say it with me, y'all. President Barack Obama. So as we move into these uncertain times with our, cur our current alternative facts president, which is cold word for lying, I urge you to respect the office, even if you don't like the man. It's going to be a long four years, y'all. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yes. And here is my ode to his queen. The only first lady to have two degrees from two Ivy League schools, Princeton and Harvard Law, if you're curious. Our first lady is undoubtedly fit, with toned arms and a company, hips and thighs strong enough to strangle a midget. In an effort, <laughs> in an effort to combat childhood obesity, First Lady Michelle Obama launched the Let's Move initiative which included exercising and vegetable gardening. To complement her grace and style, she urged us to respond to controversy in a sophisticated manner. When they go low, we go high. When they go low, we go high. A proud mother and wife, but let's be clear, she is not a friend of her children, rather a guide and a role model to them and so many others. Michelle is such a skilled strategist that she even got her husband to stop smoking cigarettes during his first presidential campaign. Now that's skill, y'all. Amen. <laughs> or days that my professional game is A1, folks have even called me Michelle Obama. And aside from being called a child of God, what better compliment could I ever receive? Yes. I salute you on this day, my dear lady. Those are some big shoes to fill. And she wore them well. Melania, I hope you're ready. Gosh, it's going to be a four interesting year, y'all. <laughs>